What is going on guys? JT Gilly back with another video and today's video is going to be huge. Literally. We have some very exciting news to go over regarding Mega Pokemon in Pokemon Go. We're going to do some legendary Heatran raids. We're going to do a very, very, very dope shiny evolution in today's video as well. I cannot wait to hop into it. And into our first Heatran raid we go. You know, honestly, at the time of recording this, we're nearing the end of August and man, this year has absolutely absolutely flown by. I mean, GoFest season is over. I mean, it just happened, but GoFest season is over. We're already almost in the ninth month of the year. Cannot wait because the end of the year is also very, very exciting. We get the Halloween event that is definitely a fan favorite. We get a Christmas event. We get kind of a Thanksgiving event. It's a great time. I can't wait to see what's going to happen throughout the rest of the year, man. Hopefully going to get some fire events, new Pokemon, new legendaries, new shinies, new research, all of that good stuff. Going to be a great time. I wonder if they're going to do any more safari zones or in-game ticketed events for the rest of the year they probably will but again freaking hats off to Niantic man they did an extraordinary job with this game considering all that's been happening in the world they've made this game so so playable from home I'm really really enjoying the game man these last couple of months have been awesome and something else that's happening a little bit more soon uh, as we're nearing the end of August we're gonna be getting a new research breakthrough for the month of September at the time of recording this they have not announced Announce what that next Pokemon is gonna be. I just hope it's something good, man. I like Scraggy. I like Shinx. I like these Pokemon. They're cool. They're not common. I get it. But man, do we need legendary Pokemon in these research breakthroughs? I mean, why not? It's four times max a month. I don't think it's asking too much to put the legendaries in the research breakthrough. I mean, they don't have to put every single one every single month, but they can do, you know, like the Reggies this month, the birds the next month, the freaking beasts this month. Who knows? Anyways, hopefully we get the announcement soon and hopefully it doesn't suck. Hopefully it doesn't suck. Down goes Heatran right there. Trio did it with the squad. Nice, nice, nice. Down it goes. The hundo is going to be 2145 and if it's weather boosted, it's going to be 2681. Heatran. 2099 that's not going to be any good but maybe because it's not going to be any good that means we can get the pink eyes no, we're not. No, we're not. Okay, 2099, not a good heat trend and not a shiny. Uh, if you guys haven't seen the last couple of videos, man, you gotta catch up because a lot has gone down in these last couple of days, man. We got our first ever Shundo in Pokemon Go. We got Shundo Genesect, a little spoiler alert there. Hopefully you guys have seen the video. The following day, we got ourselves our shiny heat trend on the first day of its availability. And then on that same day, we ran into another Hundo heat trend, which was absolutely insane. Our second Second Shundo check, two days in a row, absolutely wild. Down it goes, 2099, it is not good. In the last video, I said that I was going to do it in our next adventure, and here we are. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the first time I will ever be doing a shady evolution in Pokemon Go. We're going to be evolving our one and only Shadow Shiny Ekans that we got a couple of days ago, man. Cannot wait. This is gonna be so, so cool. Now, it does look dope like this, it really, really does, but what I I evolve it to our first ever shiny Arbok, by the way. It is going to be even more insane because Arbok is gold and black and it's going to have the red eyes with the purple aura. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my God. Yo, that is, that, oh my, that is so nice. That is so freaking nice, man. Look at that, dude. Look at that. Shadow, shiny, gold. You'll love to see it, man. Our first ever shady evolution in the game. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have any shady Pokemon. Uh, and if you have a shady Ekans, I recommend doing this because that is insane. Again, the IVs on this aren't that bad. 15, 8, 15. Could be a lot worse. What is that? Like a, a low 80, something like that. But like I said, you guys, we've got some more raids to do in the video. we got some news to discuss, which we'll actually talk about right now. Let's get to it. Ladies and gentlemen, earlier today, Pokemon Go put out a very, very exciting tweet that, you know, we knew we were going to get this at some point this year, but we didn't know when. Trainers, we have huge news coming your way, dot, dot, dot. Or should we say, mega news stay tuned and then it has a little picture right here that's really cool it's three mega stones right there sitting in the dirt i can't wait to see what it's going to be when it's going to happen how it's going to happen i just want to know more and speaking of knowing more there's been some pokemon go code miners that have found the following information that's definitely exciting mega badges were just added to the game and we're probably going to see these before mega pokemon come to the game because that's usually how it's been when they add a new feature like the badge will come first and then we'll get the announcement and all that but the unique 
mega badges are here. We have the first half on top, which is called the Mega Evolution Guru. So it's probably gonna be like, do five mega evolutions, do a hundred mega evolutions, do a thousand mega evolutions. That's just my guess. The bottom row of badges right there are called Successor. There's going to be a bronze, silver, and gold, just like there would be with any other badge. And the reason why it's called Successor, this one took me a second, is because there's going to be mega raids in Pokemon Go. Yeah, we'll talk about that in a second here, but there's gonna be mega raids, and this is pretty much gonna work just like the legendary raid badge, I'll assume. So maybe do 10, 100, a thousand or whatever the heck. We'll hopefully be seeing these guys soon and learning a lot more about it. And we got one more piece of news also, come on. Mega Pokemon assets were just added. So as you can see right there, we have a Mega Raid Egg and the Mega Raid One uh, little icons that have now been added in the game. So we're going to be getting Mega Raids in Pokemon Go. That's gonna be pretty freaking wild, man. There's the Mega Raid Egg, there's the Mega Raid Badge thing that's gonna be on top of the gym once you complete it. And the following Pokemon with their shadow forms have been added. We got Mega Venusaur, Mega Charizard X, Mega Charizard Y, Mega Blastoise, Mega Beedrill, and Mega Pidgeot. These are the Generation 1 Pokemon that have Mega Forms, so I'm going to assume the first wave of Mega Pokemon we get are going to be Gen 1 Pokemon. So Venusaur, Charizard, Blastoise, Beedrill, and Pidgeot. Let me know in the comments down below, out of these Mega Pokemon, which one is your favorite? Mine is Mega Charizard X. But that's all super exciting, man. I cannot wait to see how Mega Raids are going to work, how Mega Pokemon are gonna work, how they're gonna look, how they're gonna feel. I just mm, can't wait. Hopping in on Heatran Raid at number two of today's adventure. I'm gonna try to get a shiny in one of these videos, right? I mean, I keep getting them on stream, which is cool, but I wanna try to get one in the video for the video, man. Although, like we talked about in the last video, man, I already have the hundo. I already have, what, three or four shinies, so I'm not gonna go that hard with Heatran. I really have no reason to. We'll do, you know, we'll do a good amount. We'll do a good amount. Let me know in the comments down below how your guys' luck is with Heatran. Heatran. I know we have them for another two-ish weeks, so you know, gotta get used to them. And just like that, we're in the red with Heatran right here, tapping them out. Swampert gonna go in, bada bing, bada boom. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and hide the screen for this one. We haven't hit the screen in a while. I'm gonna hide the screen. We're gonna take a look at the CP together. Hopefully, we can get a good IV one here. If we get a surprise Shundo, I'm gonna go absolutely insane. <laughs> Three, two, one. Pick up the phone, here we go. Golden Raspberries, Revives, Hyper Potions, all that good stuff, 14 balls. Can we get a ear check? For the one time, where's my ear at? Where's my ear at? Come on, come on! Not a shiny. 2101. Two more CP than the last one. Two more CP than the last one. That's 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 tough. Also, a little bit off topic, not really. Wow, another second ball right there. I just hit lucky friends with Connor, and that's the first lucky friend I've hit in the last couple of freaking months, and it feels like forever. So we're definitely going to be getting a lucky trade. Probably in the next video, we'll get a lucky trade in. It's gonna be spicy. You know it's gotta be spicy, so I can't wait to do that. There's so many options. I mean, we can go, we can go Rayquaza, Mewtwo, Lugia, Ho-Oh, Zapdos, Raikou, uh, who knows? There's a lot of lucky trades I want to do. There's a lot of good lucky Pokemon I want to get. So we're going to have to decide then, but that's definitely coming up soon. And uh, I'm going to do something really quick, but first we have a 10 kilometer egg, just one of them. Oh my God, dude, I've hatched like five 10 kilometer eggs in the last, I don't know, couple weeks or so, and they have all been Feebas, man. Take him out, please, God. Because we got a Shadow Shiny in this video already, or sorry, because we got a Shadow Shiny lately, and because we evolved one in this video already, I thought, why not try and battle a Team Go Rocket leader and see if we can get some fire from it, man. Let me revive the squad. I actually am waiting for a little bit of a rotation here. I'm waiting for Giovanni to come back. I think that this is kind of a... Uh, I don't know, the, the shadow eligible Pokemon right now are kind of whack, like Shadow Grimer, what are we doing here? I mean, I, I'd love to get it, no offense, no offense Grimer, no offense, but I kind of wish it was cooler. But anyways, we're gonna try, and we're gonna try to get ourselves another shadow shiny Pokemon, that would be very, very nice. Gonna smack down Grimer right here, oh, he got another move off. Tap him out, tap him out right there, what you got next, buddy boy, what you got next? What, Electivire, is it Electivire? I think it is, I think I remember it being Electivire, yep. He's got a Torterra to end this thing off, and I got a Garchomp and the rest of the squad, but I don't have any shields. So this is gonna be a little tight. It's gonna be a little tight. 
Let's see if we can make this happen. Garchomp, I need you to do some damage here. Ah, all right. I don't know why on earth they gave me Swampert as a recommended. I do not agree with that whatsoever. Uh, can I get a Stone Edge off? That'd be nice. That'd definitely help alleviate the pressure, and it does. Although I think Torterra is really close to getting its charge attack, so this might this might be a bad idea. This might be a bad idea. Tyranitar, Stone Edge. It's almost over. It's almost over. Tyranitar, can you clutch it out? No, he can't. Down goes Torterra right there. Swampert clutching up. Love to see it. Thousand dust. We got seven balls and a chance at getting a shadow shiny Pokemon. Not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. Still haven't got one from the leaders, technically. I mean, I got one from Jesse. I guess she's a leader, but not like Sierra Cliff or Arlo, at least. So, gonna keep trying. Gonna keep trying. I'm not gonna give up on that. Down it goes right there. Again, though, like I said a couple seconds ago, I do miss Giovanni. I hope they bring him back because I really enjoyed battling him every month with the Team Rocket Special Research. It was always something for me to look forward to. We do have one last Heatran raid that we're gonna hop into right now, so let's go ahead and head on over to it. And here we are going in on the final Heatran trend raid of today's video man we are two for two so far i would love to go three for three and i would love to end the video with a good iv or shiny heat trend i don't i don't really i don't really care which one we pick there or both or both that's also an option bada bing bada boom down goes heat trend right there all righty all righty come on come on come on come on come on 2067 yes that is one of the worst ones we could have got. You'd love to see it. Well, at least it's going to be shiny, and we'll trade it. And and it's not shiny, and we're not going to trade it. We're going to transfer it. How about you go ahead and say hi to Professor Willow for me, since you like him so much. I've only ever seen one Heatran over a 90%. Granted, it was a hundo, <laughs> but I've only ever, in the many Heatran raids I've done in my entire career, I've only ever seen one over a 90-something. So Heatran is not the nicest in terms of IVs, but, you know, luckily. Luckily, we got our hundo, we got our shinies, we are good to go. Heatran, come on, bro, come on. Another excellent right there on the Heatran. I think this ball is going to go down. I, I can just tell. I can just tell. Sometimes you can just tell with Pokemon when the balls are going to just catch. And this is one of those This is one of those moments as I flash the phone in my screen. What? Flash the screen in my face. 2067. Heatran sucks. You know what? I'm going to do you a favor. I'm not even going to wait. I'll just transfer you right now, brother. All right. Well, we went three for three on Heatran. I can't complain. It was a good day overall. We got a Shadow Shiny Evolution. We battled the Grunt. Mega Pokemon are coming to the game very, very soon here. I cannot wait for that. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know in the comments down below how your guys' Heatran raids have been. Let me know what Mega Pokemon you guys are most excited for. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys have not already. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I will see your faces later. Deuces.